it's nice to be with you today. My name is Gregory Scott and this is your intuitive tarot reading for Friday the 23rd of May. Sorry, I had to think about the month there. Friday the 23rd of May 2014. I'm going to use the Morgan Greer deck and I'm just going to have a look at what comes up for you on this day and what you'll be working with. Okay. Right. So the energy really shifts on this day. This week has really been about um, spiritual insight and then make it, making use of that to really create something. And this day, it really overshoots the mark a little bit. What happens is you become very much focused on the physical world again. So you go from one extreme to the other. And that's normal because we do live in a world of duality, you know, up and down, left and right. That when you have a huge spiritual insight, it's it's understandable that you have a real shift into the ego as well because that's the kind of planet we inhabit. So Friday morning, real focus on the circumstances, you know, anger that you haven't found a parking space, real annoyance at, um, or resentment at the person who wronged you, and really forgetting about all of those spiritual things and focusing on what's wrong with your life in the physical world. That goes on during the day and it really um, causes you to act out of fear. So really try and beat other people or um, compete with them or be better than them. Because obviously, if you're coming from a place of fear and where things are wrong with your life, all the other people become opponents. You know, they're all people who are there to take away from you. That's the whole ego mindset. You know, that's the tape that plays. I'm, I'm full of fear, other people are in my way, I've got to get them out of the way to get what I want, da 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 da. And I had a reading a while ago with, um, with someone who told me that when that negative tape plays in your head, and I found this really very simple but very useful, when you hear that voice, you know, you're not good enough, nothing will ever happen, da da da, all of that stuff. Just kind of push against your forehead and think of it as an eject button and see that CD or the tape or the whatever, the, the, the MP3 stick or whatever, just coming out of that and ejecting that tape. Then take it and just throw it and just close the lid again and just have that better, vo you know, that better voice in your mind. Because that's just a tape that plays over and over and over again. And, you know, at this stage, it's something that's never going to end, but also that you know, the more, the better you get at this sort of stuff, the more you recognize the attributes of that voice and the more you can choose not to listen to it. And then finally, as you do that, as the day progresses, um, things do get easier. The blocks, the ego blocks start to fall away again. You connect with yourself again and uh, you get to that place of peace and harmony and you heal from that um, external world focus. So it's a day of shift but then you kind of escape that shift into negativity and you get back to self by the end of the day. Have a wonderful day. If you'd like to get in touch with me, please have a look at the website. It's gregoryscott.co.uk and I'll be with you for tomorrow's reading.